So today's video is going to be about Prince's swim class. So I put him into swim classes about a month ago and he is a year and two months uh, now. And I actually... Uh, I actually really wanted to put him into swim classes earlier, but just because of everything that has gone on this year with the corona, um, that's sweet. Uh, with the virus, it just wasn't really possible. Um, so here we are, and he is loving his swim classes, and I just wanted to kind of show you what swim classes out here in Japan is like.
So there's a pretty big portion of swim classes out here <laughs> that there's a pretty big portion of the swim class that you just can't record. You can't have, you know. <laughs> All right, so there's a big portion of the class that I can't record or, you know, do anything, take pictures or whatever um, in the locker room and whatnot. So, um, so I'm just gonna tell you guys what kind of like the, the course of action is when it comes to our swim classes. So, you know, what happened was at the beginning, I called in, I'd made some reservations to start him on swim classes. And I just started him on, to start him on swim classes. And I started him on just like a kind of a tester to see, and instead of just becoming a member right off top, just to see if he connects well with the instructors and whatnot. So, he was doing really well from the very first class. He loves the pool, he loves the water. So everything went really well. So um, I paid about $35, so 3,000 like 500 yen or something like that in order to take four weeks of tester classes. And then within those four weeks, you need to decide whether you actually want to become a member to actually take the official swim classes or not. Um, and they're the same classes, it's just, you know, um, just to test it out and see. So the fourth week of the tester classes, you're allowed to actually have somebody come in and video record poolside. So I had my husband and my mom come and take a recording of his class. What you actually have to bring out here is, you know, you can't just wear your normal swimsuit to the swim class. It's very very different you it's a bit odd if you were to wear like a bikini so like you would to like a beach or just a normal pool so out here especially you know if you have tattoos I have like two tattoos on my back I have two tattoos on my back and one on my hip so I definitely have to have all of that covered and I haven't really done this but what I would recommend is instead of getting like the tape that would cover the tattoos just buy a swimsuit that um, covers your entire body so mine looks like basically a wetsuit your child needs a swimsuit um, and you both need swim caps you have to wear swim caps um, in the pool out here in Japan so bring your swim caps and then of course like a towel and a floaty for your um, kid so first things first, what's ha what happens is you go, um, you go into the locker room, you get changed, you change your kid, and then you go out into the pool. And what we do first is they go into the pool side with a few like pool water toys, and we play for about the first 15 minutes or so. And then after 15 minutes, we go and we shower off. You usually in Japan have need to shower yourself off before going into the pool. So you shower off and then you go into the pool side and you just sit right with your feet in the pool and you just splash a little bit and then you get in first and then that's where kind of like the swim class happens. It's a lot of fun and by the fourth week you do need to pay if you actually do want to become a member like I said. For me that was two months worth of classes plus um, Two months worth of classes plus um, uh, the yearly fee. Yeah, there's like a yearly fee and monthly fee. So everything all together in cash was like $120. So like Ichiman, Nisen, Yan. Yeah. So like 12,000. Yeah, 12,000 yen. 12,000 yen to get started. And that covers your first two months of classes. Overall, I really don't think it's that bad, um, especially in Japan. In here, like here at the one that I'm going to, it's super clean. They alcohol wipe everything. Like the floor is not wet. Everything is super, super, super clean. If you're in Japan, you know what I'm talking about. Um, and the instructors are super nice, and he really is really loving it. <laughs> sticky, 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 sticky. sticky. <laughs> 